Imagine a fuel so powerful that it could run cities and industries with virtually no pollution. Now imagine the Philippines leading the world in this energy revolution. This isn't just a dream, it's the promise of deuterium. Curious about how it could transform the country? Let's dive in. The Philippines, an archipelago nation of over 7,000 islands, is renowned for its stunning natural beauty. Lush rainforests, pristine beaches, and vibrant coral reefs draw visitors from around the globe. But beneath this picturesque surface lies a hidden treasure, vast reserves of deuterium, a heavy isotope of hydrogen locked within the nation's territorial waters. Deuterium differs from regular hydrogen, protium, because it has an additional neutron, making it twice as heavy. Despite this, it behaves chemically similar to protium, but plays a crucial role in nuclear fusion and advanced fuel cells. Its abundance in seawater makes it a potential candidate for large-scale energy production through fusion. Hydrogen has three isotopes which are protium, deuterium, and tritium. This untapped resource holds the potential to transform the Philippines into a global energy powerhouse securing its energy future and propelling it to the forefront of clean energy technology. Deuterium, often referred to as heavy hydrogen, is a naturally occurring isotope of hydrogen with an extra neutron in its nucleus. This seemingly small difference gives deuterium unique properties that make it a highly sought after fuel source for nuclear fusion, the same process that powers the sun. Fusion reactions involving deuterium release immense amounts of energy, dwarfing the output of traditional fossil fuels. Unlike fossil fuels, deuterium produces no greenhouse gases, making it a clean and sustainable energy source for a world grappling with climate change. The Philippines, strategically located along the Pacific Ring of Fire, sits atop a vast reservoir of this energy-rich isotope. The Philippine Trench, one of the deepest points on Earth, plunges to depths exceeding 10,000 meters. This underwater chasm, formed by the collision of tectonic plates, contains a wealth of deuterium-rich seawater, representing a virtually untapped energy source. Tapping into this vast reserve could provide the Philippines with an abundant and sustainable energy source for generations to come. The potential benefits of deuterium exploration for the Philippines extend far beyond energy independence. The development of deuterium extraction technologies could create new industries, generate high-paying jobs, and position the Philippines as a leader in the global clean energy revolution. However, realizing this potential will require significant investment in research, infrastructure, and human capital. The journey ahead will be challenging, but the rewards for the Philippines and indeed the world make it a journey worth taking. Deuterium, a seemingly simple isotope of hydrogen, holds the key to unlocking a future powered by clean, safe, and nearly limitless energy. Unlike fossil fuels, which release harmful greenhouse gases and contribute to climate change, deuterium fusion produces no long-lived radioactive waste. This makes it an ideal candidate for meeting the world's growing energy demands without jeopardizing the health of our planet. Fusion reactions, the process of fusing atomic nuclei together, are the most energetic reactions known to science. The sun, a giant fusion reactor in the sky, has been powering our solar system for billions of years through the fusion of hydrogen isotopes, including deuterium. Replicating this process on Earth has been a long-standing goal of scientists and engineers, and significant progress has been made in recent decades. Deuterium's abundance in seawater makes it an incredibly attractive fuel source. The oceans, covering over 70% of Earth's surface, contain an estimated 4.6 quadrillion tons of deuterium. To put this into perspective, the energy potential of the deuterium contained in a single cubic kilometer of seawater is equivalent to the energy content of all the oil reserves on Earth. The potential applications of deuterium extend far beyond energy production. Deuterium is used in a variety of scientific, medical, and industrial applications, including nuclear magnetic resonance, NMR spectroscopy, which is used to study the structure of molecules, and as a tracer in biological and environmental research. As fusion technology advances, we can expect to see even more innovative uses for this versatile isotope. The Philippine Trench, a massive underwater canyon stretching over 1,320 kilometers along the eastern edge of the Philippine archipelago, 
is a testament to the immense power of plate tectonics. This deep sea chasm, formed by the collision of the Philippine Sea Plate and the Eurasian Plate, plunges to depths exceeding 10,500 meters, making it one of the deepest points on Earth. But beyond its geological significance, the Philippine Trench holds a hidden treasure, vast reserves of deuterium-rich seawater. The unique geological conditions of the Philippine Trench create an environment conducive to deuterium accumulation. As seawater circulates through the trench, it undergoes a process called thermohaline circulation, driven by differences in temperature and salinity. This process concentrates deuterium in the deeper layers of the trench, making it a prime location for extraction. The Philippines' exclusive economic zone, extending 200 nautical miles from its coastline, encompasses a significant portion of the Philippine Trench. This grants the Philippines sovereign rights to explore and exploit the resources within this vast underwater territory, including its deuterium reserves. Harnessing this potential could transform the Philippines into a major player in the global energy market. However, tapping into the deuterium reserves of the Philippine Trench will require overcoming significant technological challenges. The extreme depths, high pressure, and corrosive seawater environment pose formidable obstacles to traditional extraction methods. Innovative engineering solutions and advanced materials will be crucial for developing safe and efficient deuterium extraction technologies. Section 4, A Timeline of Discovery, Charting the Course of Philippine Deuterium. The story of deuterium exploration in the Philippines is a tale of scientific curiosity, technological advancements, and a growing awareness of the nation's vast energy potential. It's a journey that has spanned decades, marked by periods of intense research and exploration, followed by lulls as global priorities shifted. However, the pursuit of deuterium as a viable energy source has recently gained renewed momentum, driven by the urgent need for clean and sustainable energy solutions. In the 1930s, deuterium is first discovered, sparking global interest in its potential applications, including its role in nuclear fusion. During the 1950s and 60s, initial studies hint at the presence of deuterium in Philippine waters, prompting preliminary investigations into its potential as an energy source. The global energy crisis of the 1970s and 80s fuels interest in alternative energy sources, leading to renewed research into deuterium extraction technologies. The Philippines participates in international collaborations exploring the feasibility of deuterium fusion. In the 1990s and 2000s, advances in material science and deep sea exploration technologies paved the way for more ambitious deuterium extraction projects. The Philippines conducts preliminary surveys of the Philippine Trench, confirming the presence of significant deuterium reserves. Moving into the 2010s and present day, the urgency of climate change and the need for clean energy solutions reignite global interest in deuterium fusion. The Philippines, recognizing its vast deuterium potential, ramps up research and development efforts, seeking partnerships with international institutions and private companies to accelerate progress. Section 5, The Price of Progress, Funding the Future of Deuterium Exploration. Unlocking the vast energy potential of deuterium in the Philippines requires a significant financial commitment. Developing the necessary technologies for extraction, processing, and utilization will necessitate substantial investments in research and development, infrastructure, and human capital. Attracting both local and international investors will be crucial for transforming this vision into a reality. The Philippine government has a crucial role to play in creating a favorable investment climate for deuterium exploration. This includes enacting policies that encourage private sector participation, streamline the permitting process for exploration and extraction activities, and provide tax incentives for companies investing in deuterium-related technologies. International partnerships will also be essential for accelerating the development of deuterium extraction technologies. Collaborating with countries at the forefront of fusion research, such as the United States and other members of the European Union, can provide the Philippines with access to cutting-edge knowledge, expertise, and financial resources. Private sector investment will be critical for driving innovation and scaling up deuterium extraction operations. 
Venture capitalists, energy companies, and technology giants all have a role to play in funding the development of new extraction technologies, building the necessary infrastructure, and commercializing deuterium-based energy solutions. Investing in education and workforce development is equally important. Training a new generation of Filipino scientists, engineers, and technicians will be essential for ensuring the long-term success of the deuterium industry. This includes providing scholarships, establishing specialized training programs, and fostering collaborations between universities and research institutions. Don't miss out on updates about the Philippines' journey to becoming an energy superpower. Like, share, and hit the bell icon to stay informed, and drop a comment below on what you think about this bold vision. Always keep working in good faith. Mabuhay ang ating bansang Pilipinas. Be grateful.